Hey guys, Tampa Tech, and this is how to replace a laptop LCD screen. Basically, you just want to pry off the bezel, it just unclips in most cases on most laptops, or you can use a plastic credit card. Once you have the bezel off, you'll expose the screw holes and the screws. This is a cost to sell your broken laptop, by the way. This is a cost of an LCD screen, or if you decide this is the cost of a new laptop. So it's definitely worth it to try to fix your broken screen. So you just want to get a micro Phillips head screwdriver and just unscrew it. There's four screws all around the LCD screen. Just comes right off after you take off those four screws and you want to obviously power down first before you take it all apart. You want to lift the latch and pull off the ribbon cable connection. The part number is on the back of the broken LCD screen. You want to confirm the new part number that it matches the old LCD screen. When you plug in the ribbon cable connection, make sure it's flush and tight and secure and the latch goes all the way completely down. Otherwise, you'll get lines showing up on the screen. You want to lift up the screen, line it up with the screw holes. In this case, the screw holes don't line up, like most of the people say in the reviews. So I got a metal drill bit and I drilled out and opened up the holes. You can just mount the LCD panel the way it is on the top two screws, but the other bottom screws won't line up. The bezel will actually ultimately secure it. Now it fits perfectly with the screw holes opened up, the screws fit. Now put the four screws in surrounding the LCD panel using the micro Phillips head screwdriver. Next, you wanna line up the bezel on the bottom first and then work your way up to the top. Turn it sideways so you can see if there's any gaps and secure the bezel to the laptop. Looks good. And next I got some protective covers to prevent it from cracking again. I ordered the waterproof keyboard skin to prevent any kind of other disasters 